Welcome back to 10 About Town, everyone. I'm Brittany Bailey, live in the heart of Gatlinburg as we count down to the big midnight annual 4th of July parade to kick off Independence Day here in Gatlinburg. And of course, if we're talking about this special event, we can't forget to talk about the man who really started it all, George Hawkins. Of course, you may know him as the former mayor and community leader. He died this past weekend at 79 years old. He created the Midnight Independence Day concert, the Fantasy of Lights Christmas Parade, and the New Year's Eve ball drop. He was to be honored tonight, actually, before the parade began. He, of course, was larger than life and a personality no one can ever replace. A visionary, leader, friend. Those are just a few of the countless words to describe George Hawkins. His work in Gatlinburg ranged from hairstylist to mayor and director of special events. George came to Tennessee when still a teenager and at a young age to Gatlinburg. While a stylist, he worked with celebrities and some of Gatlinburg's most prominent women, including the grand dame of Gatlinburg, Wilma Maples, the owner of the Gatlinburg Inn. Those who knew him said he was also instrumental in getting Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies to Gatlinburg. In short, he was a legend. Now tonight, the city was to honor George Hawkins before the midnight parade, and city leaders did share with us that while they're saddened to hear of his passing, they're still honored to celebrate his legacy as the founder of the Gatlinburg Midnight Parade with a very special float. And today, we found some of those friends and loved ones working on the float. They say George Hawkins was a special man who loved Gatlinburg. George founded this parade in 1976 and has been a part of the parade year after year after year. And this year he's being honored as to have his own float um, as the founder of the parade. But unfortunately, yesterday morning, George passed away. Now, one of our favorite memories of George Hawkins was that he always used to say that he liked it to rain before a parade. And frankly, looking at the skies, he might get his wish. Why was that? He said that all of the lights just look so much better on those shiny, rainy streets. So maybe it will rain in honor of George Hawkins tonight. But for more.